All right, welcome back again. This is fractions on a number line and looking specifically at mixed number fractions. So let's take a look at this first one. Mixed number fractions always have a whole number and a fraction. So this is one as our whole number and a half as our fraction. If we were going to show this on a number line, we need to look at the denominator, which is two, and that means our fraction has one over two and two over two as its whole, which means the next number on this number line is three over two, and the last fraction on this number line is four over two. So if we were to show one half, we would make one large jump for this large space below and then we would show one more jump to three halves why would we show it that way well if we were to break our jump into a smaller jump, our first one, we would have one small jump and a second jump, which is why we have one large jump for our one whole. But if we're jumping by halves, this is a half, this is a half, and this next jump is a half. So this one whole jump has two halves in it. And since we didn't do another whole jump, we only did half of a jump. Three halves is where we would stop on the number line. So this jump shows one whole jump and a half jump, which is one whole and a half. Let's look at another one. So this mixed number has one whole and two fourths. That means this number line is broken into fourths. One fourth two-fourths, three-fourths, four-fourths for our one whole, five-fourths, six-fourths, seven-fourths, and eight-fourths. So how would we show this? Since our number line is broken into fours, we can do single jumps, fourth, one, two, three, four, that's one whole. And then we 